Greetings, YouTube. This is Bilch Diver at ThriveForms.org or TabletRomps.com. Uh, this is, is a video on installing the ADB drivers, at least using Windows. For your Toshiba Thrive, that has been a constant issue with new users on installing ADB, ADB drivers, so here's a video on it. I'm going to post the link to this ThriveForms post below, and this is where you download it, current version 1.3 for Windows 7, Vista, or XP. When you download it, you will see this zip file. It says USB ADB drivers English multi x86 x64.zip. Zoom in a tiny bit. Alright, unzip it to the, to the folder and oh, that was my bad. You run it I forgot to run as administrator because I'm limiting myself. Yes. Yes, I'm sure I want to install. Okay. There I am. Welcome to the driver installation wizard. Hit next. Install this driver software anyway. It's going to take a minute or two. Now while we're waiting, let's just make sure that there's my Thrive EB, and I plugged in the USB port cord into the mini USB port to connect to my laptop. Okay, and it looks like it is the driver for successfully installed. Toshiba Thrive Android USB device. Finish. Now, all I have to do, okay, is plug in the USB cord that I plugged into my Thrive, and, I don't know if you see this, enable USB debugging on your Thrive. Okay, so you go to your Thrive, and you go Settings, Applications, development, USB debugging, OK. And you'll see it, there we go, oh, looks like I plugged on the wrong USB cord, OK. Now USB debugging is in, now this is the cord for my Thrive, let's plug that in, upside down. There we go. And I got USB debugging connected. And a little honeycomb icon. Honeybee! And installing device driver software. Finished, restart required. I always hate autoplay. All right, close. Okay. Okay, we are now rebooted. As I have also downloaded the uh, software development kit, so I've also got QTATB, which is a visual representation of the Android debug bridge. Open that up and I don't know if you can see it, but the sheer fact that it's loaded means that we're good to go. To turn USB debugging off on the tablet, it disappears. Turn it back on. Turn it back on and it comes back. So much so, this is also how you can get a screenshot. Bam! Also, type in ADB commands here. So, that's ADB.